Yo, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Guns Locked. I ain't no bum, don't have no sons, don't need a bun to get ketchup off of the sink. I go on runs, it ain't so fun, we'll drink some pop to wash down all of the beef. Yo, it's your boy Gunther the Great, and today is like, yo, we're gonna get things popping because you guys see this freaking pineapple on top of my head. I'm gonna show you exactly how to do my favorite hairstyle because I literally rock this every single day. Not only because I have to wear my hair like this at work, but because everybody's been asking me and it just looks right with the stage that my hair is in. And because everyone knows with dreadlocks, you know that your hair goes through stages. And sometimes these stages are just like, bruh, I don't want to go through this stage, but I have to go through this stage because my hair is like on its way to paradise or something like that. You just got to know that your hair is getting in the way that you need it to be. Amen. Praise God. <laughs> Everybody's been asking me, yo, how do you do your hair like that? How do you do your hair like that? Please do a tutorial on how you put your hair up. And literally, it's so simple, but your hair has to be a certain length to pull it off correctly. Because I noticed that in my old pictures, I was like, Ugh, I cannot pull that hair look. I could not pull that hairstyle off so I would not suggest doing it at such a younger hair stage but once you get to the part to where like it looks like a pineapple I think it looks really legit and looks really cool so let's jump straight into this but I might throw in a freebie for you so I'll show you guys that one as well actually I will throw in a freebie so hit that thumbs up for the freebie so the number one thing that we got to do right now for the tutorial is I'm gonna take my hair down magically hold on all right so my hair is down I just magically took it down um, I don't know exactly how I did that but it is down and it's ready to go I believe you are you ready to go hair Yes, my hair is ready to go. Okay, we're good. <laughs> All right, number one thing that you are gonna need for the Gunther the Great hairstyle. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and name it the Gunther the Great hairstyle. Yeah, that sounds great. That sounds Gunther the Great. <laughs> I'm so cheesy guys, I'm sorry. All right, so this is what I'm rocking right now. I have a huge headband that you can just like, whoa, I look freaking ghetto right now. This is so legit. So if you wanna wear your hair like this, you can just be weird and do that. But the number one thing you're gonna need is a hair tie. But what I like to do with this hair tie, I don't like using the regular hair ties that are just like literally this small. And I like to use this one. So I do this and I just wrap it. You guys know how to do this. Like you put it in here and you wrap it around again so that it loops and it makes a smaller one, you know what I mean? So you make yourself a smaller hair tie. So this gives you enough stretch so that your hair doesn't be pulled at the root because everyone knows if your hair is pulled at the root, it's either gonna pull back your hairline, you're gonna look like a young Kobe Bryant, or your hair is just literally gonna pull straight from your roots and out of your head. So you really don't want your hair to have any stress at the root, so you really want a bendy one, and this just really works good. Get something really flexy, and I really suggest using a headband so you can fold it in half and use the extra strength and the stretch in the headband. So then Number one thing you're gonna do is I like to throw my head down so I can get all the hair in one location. Push everything down like so. Are we in focus? Yes, we are. So I push everything down literally like this. How we looking? Yes, we're still. Oh shoot, hold up. And I like to run my fingers through it sometimes to kind of just like let it be free. And I grab it all up. That's the first step. You can literally grab it all up and your hair is already halfway there. There it is, right on the top of my head. So I kind of pull it forward. Do not really pull at the roots because if you pull at the roots, it really does stretch out your scalp and it'll like yank your dread out of your head and you really don't want that to happen. So I pull it towards at the center of my head. See what I'm talking about? Then all I do is I take this hand, grab it right there, make sure all the dreads are in my hand. Then I grab this and I just bring it over and I put it on. But now it just looks weird. It looks like a freaking rain uh, waterfall is going off the top of my head. It looks like a sprinkler. So what I do now is I grab it and then I just stretch it out and then it comes down. And it makes your hair look super full. So right now my hair looks really full. Cool thing is, is that it just makes it look very vibrant and you look like a cooler person, I don't know. People want to talk to you when your hair is like this. Like people actually engage conversation with me at work just because my hair. Ooh, I like your hair. You have a really crazy hairstyle. Ooh, your hair looks really nice. You know who Kid and Play is? You really remind me of him. Can I get an autograph? Oh my goodness, you guys don't even know how much compliments you would get if you really pull off the GDG hairstyle, trust. So this is like how it all looks, you know? You got the front view looking like a pineapple, side view looking like a pineapple as well. This is literally SpongeBob's house on my head. You get the back. The back might look weird, but I don't really care. The way to accomplish this look is like, you want it to come down and out. The way I like to accomplish this is I want it to come down and out, and I want it to be on the top of my head, and I like when they stand up in the middle. See how there's some standing up in the middle as well? They're going straight up and stuff. I don't I don't like for them to look like this. I don't like their hair to look like this. This just, for me, I don't like the way this looks. I like when it stands up and it's like this, you know? And I really don't have too much falling forward because then it looks weird like that. But I like when they just come up and there's some in the middle standing up. Well, that, my friends, is how you accomplish the Gunther the Great hairstyle. And I'm out of a breath. 
Wow, you guys really wore me out on this one. I was gonna throw in a freebie for you, so this is free, you guys don't have to pay for this one, but I'm gonna show you exactly what I do. You know how there's there's all these hairs coming down a lot? There's a lot of these hairs. Well, I'm gonna show you exactly what I did one day that really kind of just changed my whole perspective on how I did this. So all I do is I grab, I'll grab two of them just ran, at random, and I'll start tying them up, up here. And tie them to where they wrap around perfectly. I mean, not perfectly, but they line up to where it wraps around as a halo on your head. And then you grab another two, and then you go backwards this time, and tie them. Align with the hair tie. And this is a little freebie for you guys, so you could try it if your hair is long enough. And then you just keep doing it over and over, and I'll show you how it looks when you're finished doing the ties. And if you guys want me to go to more depth on how I do this, I can try to do a better video uh, just for this. And I'm actually planning another hairstyle video real soon, so stay tuned for that. I'm gonna show you exactly like what this does and what it accomplishes when you tie your hair like this. So I did a little bit, and this is all this does is like it takes some of the hair that is like coming down over your ear, because I don't really like when the hair comes over my ears and it just bugs me sometimes. And some days I don't even mind it, but other days I'm very ir irritable, I guess, and I just pull it up like this. So if you want to tie it up, you could just do that and follow the steps that I did, and you could pull off my hair look or my hairstyle but that's how I do it hopefully you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did give it a thumbs up and leave a comment of what you guys want me to do I'll definitely take it into consideration but besides that hope you guys enjoyed it and hope you guys have an amazing day God bless are you jealous fellas singing all why are you jealous